Hello, I am Yed4455, and welcome back to Zoo Tycoon 2. Right, we are doing the Michigan, the Michigan, ha, huh? the Mission, uh, the Mysterious Panda, which I got my two pandas. I have Giant Panda 1 and Li Ming. And what I have to do now is after I get, I got them, I now have to meet their advanced needs and successfully breed them. So they're probably going to take a long time. But that's what we got to do. So let's see if I can build anything else. Um, I could definitely get these caves going. Snow cave, small snow cave, cubbing den. Raised sleeping platform, large cave rock. Let's go to cubbing den. I'm kind of curious about that. I mean, it looks pretty big, but you know what? Let's do it. See what we can get. All right, Chris. These guys, I think you have everything you need. You don't really want any toys, but you do have a toy out there. Uh, you guys are looking good. The moose are fine. I lost all my bison. All right, well, let's just do something like this, just to see what we can get. Alright, there's really no other animals I want, need to get. All the people are really happy. I mean, Zoo Fame is five stars, by the way. So that is always a plus. Alright, and people are flocking over to see the pandas. So that is always a good sign. All right, what kind of stuff of toys do you want? You could use a big ball. So we'll put that in there. You already checked the trees, nothing you could like or use. African buffalo grow, grew up. There's a lot of animals over here. At least in that wetland exhibit. Yeah, everyone's flocking over to these pandas now. Which again is good. So yeah, they're, they really flocked over here. And advanced me needs definitely, uh, I need to meet those. So that's almost done. Cost a thousand dollars. It cost fourteen hundred to build. So let me go ahead and move this rock over. All right, put this cubbing den in. There we are. Now hopefully that still works for privacy needs. Yes, there you can. Okay. They can go rest in there, which is perfect. All right. So, yeah, I just got to get these guys to mate. Which, I mean, they were green a second ago, and the fact that everything is red and yellow. A little concerning, so this is definitely going to take a while with these guys. So, we'll just check out the rest of the zoo. Let them be. I've given them everything they could possibly ever need. So let's see what other animals I can get. Um, I already have zebra. I have camels. I have hippos in there. The rhino. Um, you're not savanna biome. Eh, really nothing. Let's go ahead and just say no to everybody. Let's get in the next line of animals in. See what they can give us. Alright, now let's see. Will you actually drink something? I know you're really thirsty. There you go. I think you just glitched out, so yeah. Okay, you're gonna go drink something finally. It just took me uh, keeping you in your cage for a long time. But you're working. But you're finally, finally drinking water. And then hopefully you'll go seek your privacy needs. Alright, perfect. So that fixed that one. 
All right, animals. What do we got? Uh, javelin rhino, which critically endangered. Be cool to have, but cost a lot. Um, I think I have most of these. Well, not most of them. At least I don't have exhibits for them. Jaguar would be cool. Bengal tiger would be cool, but they do cost a lot of money. Maybe the jaguar, though. That might be something to consider. Alright. Crocodiles are doing exceptionally well. Why can you not reach this? Why would you need to? Alright, I'll go and do it for you. And then I'll try to clean up and do your job for you. Alright, there we are. Excellent. Alright, everything's looking good there. Everything here is making me a lot of money. Alright, that's 2,000, so you definitely are making me profit now. That's made 3,000. Or all these snack carts, yeah. In the thousands, in the 500s, thousands. Close to 4,000 there. Uh, you're at almost 4,000. You're almost at two. And then the one that made me the most money, this first gift cart, which has made $9,000. That's an insane amount of money. All right, animals. Aha, black rhino. I will definitely, definitely throw two black rhinos in here. So I do, the rhino just so happens to be my favorite animal, so I'd definitely be throwing them in there. So I need $20,000 once to do that. A black leopard would be really cool. So I think I'll throw... Yeah, I think I'll throw these two black rhinos in there. And then I will throw a black leopard. I think that will work. To perfection. Alright, you're out and about. I'm gonna eat bamboo from the dish. Right, the other one is in there. That's fine. That's a weird little thing on the back. Alright, those turtles are doing fine. Penguins are doing fine. Alright, can you get any other type of structure or tree? No. So that has to meet your privacy needs, which is fine. These guys are fine. I think the only one that has not really met the privacy needs would be that giraffe. Everyone else looks good. These guys should be alright. Everyone here is good. It's just weird that the crocodiles are not getting any privacy from from anything here. Like it's it's so weird. But that's none of my business. And look, just look at how popular these pandas are. Alright, they need some entertainment. I mean, these pandas are really popular. To the point where they already made $2,000. It is insane. Right, you're going to drink water, which is good. Going to eat bamboo. Yeah, the only problem with them being this popular is that they're going to be going back and forth to seek privacy a lot. Which is going to be a big blow to all their other stuff. But we'll make it work. I mean, the whole rest of this point is to uh, ensure that these guys breed. And so you met your food needs. I mean, look at that. And your privacy is... You just walked out of the... Of the cave and your privacy is already at 100%. 
And then, yeah, it, I mean, it comes out and then right back in. It's ridiculous how, how quickly that privacy needs goes up. Now, with that being said, everything else looks good, and people are spending money. And I'm almost at my goal of getting to twenty thousand dollars. Right, what are you going to do? You're going to play with the pursuit ball. Which that is good. Yeah, all of this is good. Well, I'm happy with everything that is happening over there. And I think people really like these penguins, too. And somebody just gave a donation to something. Uh, what made 4,000? Caribou. And the penguins are three, the muskox are three. You're grooming. All right. All that's looking good. All my moose are looking good. There's a lot of moose in here though. I mean, I could release some to the wild, but meh. We'll keep them for now. I have a lot of gazelles. The little baby giraffe. Which is cool. Let's do a quick little view of the zoo. I do have some baby hippos. Hippos I could probably release at some point as well. Three crocodiles. A lot of these coastal turtles. These green, green sea turtles. I got a lot of little ones in here. I think I had, I think the mother laid like four eggs or something. And then I have some baby leatherback sea turtles, which these are cool because they're number one, they're critical. Number two, they're just cool. No, I guess they laid more eggs than just two. I thought there was only two. But the the most important goal. Is to get these two pandas to mate. And they do not like being around people at all. I mean, I'm sure this one just left the den and it's already. So I'm thinking I might need to move everything closer to the den. And let's get you done drinking. So this way they don't have to move too far. So that they can maybe start interacting with each other. So that's the only downside to this. Because, I mean, you're probably already good. Alright, you're going to use the bathroom. Then you're probably heading back in here. Just as you're coming out. And I just... I'm just curious to how quickly this privacy needs fades. Like, that is what I'm really curious about. You just play with the pursuit ball, which is good. I might need to give him other things to do. Alright, finally they're interacting. Alright, what else can I give you? Right, you want a misty spring, so I'll give you one. Something like that. Alright. Ball with rattle, small toy ball. Yeah, let's get a feeder ball. Alright, you're going to eat. All that's fine. 
Alright, what is this thing? Squeaky toy. I mean, everything's looking good. It's just, it's just a case of trying to get them to mate. And it's tough trying to meet their advanced needs when they're sleeping half the day. That being said, this one looks fine. The other one, not so much. Right, let's get the feeder ball out here. You're going to go look at feeder ball. You're exiting the den. Alright, I think now that there's a lot less people, I think they might be alright. So they're, they can actually start taking care of some of their advanced needs. Alright, you played with the ball. You're rolling for some reason. Yeah, all that is good, but I need you guys to mate. Mating is important. Right, you're going to go eat, because yeah, you are starting to get hungry. You're probably going to drink something soon, which actually you're doing right now. And the sea turtles are growing up. That is fine. And I do have the $20,000. Let me uh, wait to twenty one just to ensure I got a little extra cash. All right, what are you going to do? Going to the bathroom. You're eating. Play chasing. Alright, I just need you guys to mate. That's all I need you to do. Uh. Alright, what are you doing? You're walking. You're being weird. You're gonna go play with the feeder ball. And yeah, your privacy needs are rising again. Alright. Time for the black rhinos. One there, and a male. Alright, what do you eat? Uh, that grass will work for you. Excellent. And I think you can use... Alright, you are actually fine with the salt lick. And I am down a few thousand dollars. Maybe the month changed or whatever. That's fine. Yeah, you're going to go rest again because... uh. For some reason, you like to hide in there. Alright, moose one died of old age, but I got a lot more moose in there. Some young, some old, so that's fine. And then I did say the next one I wanted to do was... Black's, the Black Leopard. Yeah. So I do think everything here is going to be fine. They're both going to use the salt lick. Excellent. How can you not reach it? 
I don't quite understand. I mean, you can definitely get in there. Alright, you guys have to mate. Just hurry up, get it over with. So that I can win this mission. I mean, it'll happen eventually. Alright, they're play chasing. And you're going to rest already. Did you not just get out? Like, that's what I'm not understanding. Like, it just got out of the cave. It play chased and then it's going back in. No, you're staying out here. Alright, fine. If you want to, that bad here. You're going to investigate something. Yeah, that makes no sense to me how it just all of a sudden... I have to go back. I just got out, but I have to go back in. It's frustrating. At that rate, they're never going to produce. There's not even a lot of people here anymore. That's what I'm not understanding. I can understand if there was like, you know, a good 50 to 100 people, but there's like five, six. There's a grand total of six people there. See, so yeah, and then as soon as you get out, she's going to want to go in. So we're going to be at the same issue. Yeah, and is that the way? He starts leaving. I'm, I'm waiting for it. Now you're play chasing, okay. That's fine. Yeah, now you're gonna go seek privacy. just played with that. What are you doing? You're looking at the den. You want to go rest. You're going to go drink. Okay. Fine, I guess. But I'm really not liking that. You know, I, I really just need you guys to just produce, get it over with, win me the mission. But that, then again, these pandas did make $5,000 in relatively short order. I mean, granted, it cost me $50,000 for just one of them. And how many people are over here? That's a lot of animals. But, you know, it's Africa. And I'm half expecting his... uh privacy to just shoot up <laughs> alright you're viewing animals from the bench that's okay with me uh, what wants more space what was that crocodile okay One of you guys, Croc 3, I'm actually just going to put you up for adoption. And then that should... Yeah, that should help the space. Excellent. Alright, Caribou died of old age. That's fine. Alright. You're going to go eat. You're going to go drink. Now, hopefully, you guys mate right after. That would be ideal. 
But I don't know if it's gonna work that way. Both three wants the mate, but can't. Going to bathroom. You're going to go investigate something. You do. You just, This guy just has to get off of whatever he's doing there. And then you will indeed have the space. Yeah, and look at that. Like, it, she just got out. And then your privacy needs. Again. Uh, they're play chasing now. Which again is fine if you get somewhere with it and you're going to go rest. All right, guys, I think this is actually going to be a good place to put in a pause. Uh, I thought I would be able to take care of this in this episode, but apparently they are being stubborn. So, yeah, if you like what you watch, please consider subscribing to my channel. Also, don't forget to check me out on Facebook and Twitter. Stay up to date with all the latest news. And also head on over to Patreon and support all my projects over there. So I am yet 4455. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.